It was the best thing that I think I've ever done for myself. Oh, you got my nerves today. Coming from the complicated queen. Let me show you how to meal prep like a boss. Hello guys, welcome back to the vlog. Today we are doing the ultimate reset. I'm talking like a full census and I'm so excited to bring you guys along. Let's get it girl. So I feel like I may have found the secret to really thriving in a new year. The week after the holidays is totally meant for decompressing and unplugging. And girl, that's exactly what I did. I knew that with me going back to work, and it was just me with Cruz. I needed to just focus on what I needed to do and just not worry about being present on socials or just like having to answer to anybody. It was the best thing that I think I've ever done for myself. Also, I feel like for that week, I kind of was able to like dibble dabble in the goals I've set for myself. Like, you know, kind of like a soft start, kind of see what works right now and what I can kind of hold off on. And it's doing wonders. I feel like I released so much in 2022 and I became the woman that I've always dreamed of and always knew that I had the potential to be. And I think that's because I really sat with myself and really thought about what was important and where my priorities lie. And I feel like in that releasing and letting go and making space for all that I can be has really just made me look at 2023 as a true year of a refresh and a reset just to be everything that I know that I can be. I have a really good feeling about this year and I think taking that first week of the year to just be and just unplug really set me up to just have an open mind, a fresh mind to take everything in for this year. And with that being said, I'm so excited because Michael is back. Just having him back just makes me feel so ready to really start the year. So this is the official start of 2023. Really excited because we're going to church today and we have been watching church online since the pandemic and it hasn't really felt the same as like being in person, being connected, being in a community. And I feel like that's a major reset for my soul just to be able to start off my week at church in a space filled with connection and reassurance. And I'm feeling really good about it, sis. Okay, here is the fit for church. Cute little sweater dress from H&M. Got on these boots from Target. And I love the boots from Target. They are so cute. I wear them all the time in the winter and it just goes with so much. So cute. All right, let's go. Do you have fun at church today? Yeah. Was church fun today? Yeah. <laughs> getting on my last good nerve Good's today. Up. You are, <laughs> oh, oh. <laughs> you are on my nerves today. Oh. <laughs> All I wanted to do was take one good picture, just of the two of us, our first picture 2023, and then here you go. That's not, that's not all she wanted to do. Oh my gosh. I just can't. I have, I have confirmation that that's not all she wanted to do. It's okay. He's still trying to get like on the time because Nigeria was six hours ahead. 
Yeah, so six hours ahead. Yeah, so he's still a little tired, but yay, Michael's back. He's back. Anyways, okay, my mom just got here. My sister's on her way, but I'm about to meal prep. And what I have found that's been super helpful with like having a full, like successful week and really being able to set yourself up for success is being able to prep all of your meals i'm talking lunches dinners snacks bag it all up together so that when the week hits you don't even have to think about it i also feel like something else that's been really helpful with like getting everything set up to have our meals for the week is really being like strategic with how we go about our sundays so this morning michael got groceries like before we went to church so that after we got home it's already here and i can just go ahead and like start prepping it game changer life changer let me show you guys what i'm making this week like my lunches dinner snacks i'm gonna show you everything girl for lunches and dinners this week i'm gonna do chicken sausage i'm also gonna do ground beef um lean ground beef with this taco seasoning and then two chicken packs with this fire pepita salsa like this is so good pepita salsa and chicken together with some cheese mm. and then i'm gonna do some carrots sweet peas jasmine rice and some red potatoes and for snacks i've really been going like with whole foods some yogurt and it's really giving so i'm gonna do some fresh strawberries um this key lime light and fit greek yogurt this light and fit is so good i love the raspberry one but they were out um so i'm really excited for this because i do love some good key lime and then i'm gonna do this um, already hard cooked peeled eggs um, and do some carrots and then some fresh mini peppers. All right, girl, let me show you how to meal prep like a boss. So a little pro tip on meal prepping, and if you just wanna have all of your lunches, dinners ready, don't overcomplicate it, okay? Coming from the complicated queen, okay? Don't overcomplicate it. Put everything that you want in a bakeable way. I don't even know if that's a word, but it is today, okay? Bake it, make large portions of it, stick it in the oven, and it's easy to go. It can cook, you don't even have to think about it. And then you can move on to little things that don't take that long to cook, and then voila, it's all good. Just pre-packaging your carrots, bell peppers, whatever it is that you have your intention to eat. But when the wheat comes, you don't feel like packaging it. Like, I feel like this takes care of it if you just do it at the beginning of the week.
watching me like jazz that's a lot you doing the most but you know what it's so worth it i feel like just taking the time and resetting yourself giving yourself the time to just prep everything at the beginning of the week and just having a full sin like clean reset it really makes all the difference and i truly believe that a clean space creates a clear mind because your space is organized everything is where it needs to be it just allows you to refocus and put your inner in areas where they need to be for you to meet your goals sis okay so hope that you enjoyed today's video love you guys so much and i hope to see you in the next one bye